Piers Morgan has once again blasted Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, following a report about one of his other court cases. It has been claimed that the Duke of Sussex suffered substantial hurt, embarrassment and distress after a Mail on Sunday report about one of his other court cases inspired a feeding frenzy of hostile comments online. Following this, the ex-GMB presenter Piers Morgan took to Twitter to blast the Duke. He wrote, Is the little twerp ever not hurt and distressed? Imagine bleeding like this when there's a war raging? Morgan, who previously lashed out at Prince Harry and Meghan Markle for their widely covered interview with Winfrey in March, used Twitter to share his thoughts on the new Apple TV Plus series. Because the one thing the world really needs in the middle of a pandemic is yet more preaching lectures on compassion, mental health and emotional well-being from a whiny little brat who spends his entire time publicly trashing his family, Morgan wrote. In a previous interview he said I think Harry and Meghan Markle needs to stop whining, period. The 54-year-old English journalist told us weekly exclusively at the British Academy Britannia Awards sponsored by Jaguar Land Rover in Beverly Hills. I think she's an actress whining too much. I say that with great respect. But the most successful members of the royal family, the Queen, the Queen's mother, the most beloved always understood, you never explain, you never complain, you do your duty and everyone loves you. The moment you start yapping away moaning about everything, people go, hang on. You're living at our expensive palaces, with servants. So maybe get a better sense of reality. It's a lot, the 38-year-old Duchess, who gave birth to son Archie, five months, in May, explained in the doc. So you add this on top of just trying to be a new mom and trying to be a newlywed, and also thank you for asking, because not many people have asked if I'm okay, but it's a very real thing to be going through behind the scenes. Morgan added that he isn't a massive fan of the former Suits star who he claimed to be close to in the past. I knew her quite well. And like a lot of people, she dropped me as soon as, she stopped looking at me the moment she met Prince Harry and she's done that to a lot of people, he told us. I just think she's somebody who is laser focused on becoming a member of the royal family and has discovered that you can't be a celebrity actress playing that game if you're a member of the royal family. It's not how it works, in Britain, the members of the whole family are almost all the civil list. Their houses get paid for by us. Their security is paid for by us, the taxpayers. And with that comes a sense of duty. And I don't think Meghan Markle's quite worked out what duty involves. She's too busy trying to be a celebrity, lecturing us all how to lead our lives and it's just not a very clever move. Speaking to The Independent, Diane Abbott, the MP for Hackney North and Stoke Newington, said she would not comment further on the case because court proceedings are ongoing. Ms Abbott's comments come after it emerged Prince Andrew, the Queen's 61-year-old second son will face a civil case over allegations he sexually assaulted Virginia Jufri in 2001 when she was only 17 years old. Ms. Abbott said, This is really quite sad for the Queen in her platinum jubilee year. I wouldn't want to say more than that. We will only know when the court case is completed. But it is a horrible thing to happen in the Queen's jubilee year.